ladies and gentlemen it's design slider whether you want to reset or format your windows 11 partially where you will be able to recover all the files you have or you want to do a complete reset or format where you will wipe everything back to original factory state or condition this video is for you very quickly i'll be showing you two methods to reset or format your windows if the first method doesn't work for you for any reason then the second method will work for you so let's get into it come to your window search and type settings search for settings and here is the settings app right here oh by the way Another way to get it is you go to your Windows Start button, right mouse click and select Settings. Whatever means you use, use any means you know to get to the Windows Settings app. And here we're going to Systems under Settings. Systems. Then under System we are going to Recovery. Click on Recovery. And under Recovery now we are going to reset this PC. And here is the button to reset this PC. Click on it. Then you will have these two options. The first option is to keep your file, which is the partial recovery that I talked about. It will allow you to reset or format and you will have access to your files. The other option is to remove everything where you will reset your Windows 11 back to factory state or factory original condition. It depends on your choice. Whichever one you want to do, choose your choice here. But for the sake of this demo, I will be going with keep my files and here you will have to decide how you would like to reinstall Windows 11 for your device after you reset it it's either you go with cloud download or you go with local reinstall please take note at this point for you to have these two options that means you need to have internet access on your device if you do not have internet access then you will have to go with local reinstall that's the only option you will have for you to go with cloud download, you need to be ready for about more than 4 gig of data. But either cloud download or local reinstall is actually going to give you the same end result of new Windows 11 after you reset or format this. For the sake of this video, I am going to go with local reinstall. And this change setting is just to say maybe you want to change your mind to go with cloud download, which we have already decided. So you may not need this. Then I go next. And here we are ready to reset this PC. But before we go ahead, I recommend my personal opinion anyway that you check all the apps that will be removed. So click on view apps that will be removed. When you click on that, you see the apps that will be wiped off your device. You may need to take a note, write it down somewhere, or you take a screenshot of this so you can later download them again and reinstall all of them back into your device after you reset this PC. So after taking note or taking a screenshot, you click back button and finally click the reset button to start the reset process. Reset this PC. Oops, I'm not able to continue. That is because my device is not connected with the charger into power source. And this is for you to note that for you to reset your PC, you need to connect your device and your reset will be successful. If in any case, this doesn't work for you for whatever reason it is, then let us try the second method. And for the second method, we are going to advanced options. So to do that, you go to your window start and on the window start, get to the power button and you see the power options. Now, before you proceed, hold down your shift key while you're holding down your shift key. Then you click restart button here. And when your computer boots up after the restart, then you will have these options here. From here, you select troubleshoot. And on that troubleshoot, you will have the option to reset this PC. Next is you will have the same option we have seen before where you can choose either to keep your files or you want to remove and wipe everything off your device for a complete reset. So make your choice and decide. From there, you proceed with the instructions that shows on screen to reset your device. Subscribing to this channel is good for you and me. Therefore, subscribe here and like this video by giving it a thumbs up so you can see my other videos. Thank you for watching.